Lisa, welcome back to my channel. So I have lived in Spain for a really long time and I have eaten a lot of Spanish food. And in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you the food that you absolutely must try if you ever visit Spain. So the first one is tortilla española or tortilla de patata. This is delicious. It doesn't have that many ingredients in it. It's a fairly simple dish, but it tastes amazing. It's basically just diced potato, diced onion, immersed in loads of olive oil, and then mixed with egg, and then cooked in a very specific way so that it turns into this like circular shape. It is amazing. You really have to try it if you ever come to Spain. Next up is jamón serrano, or Spanish ham. This is ham that has not been cooked, it's been cured in salt. And it's just delicious. Like this ham has the most intense, amazing flavor. It's really nice eaten with breadsticks or on crusty bread or just eaten alone because it's so, so delicious. Next up is ensalada rusa. Ensalada rusa, or Russian salad, originates from Russia but it was so, so popular in Spain that they just kind of adopted it as one of their own dishes. It's such a summer dish. It's really refreshing. It's like hard boiled egg, peas, carrots, sweet corn. A lot of people add tuna as well. I don't like tuna. And mayonnaise. And you mix it all together and it's just a lovely, delicious, cold summer salad. Then we have croquetas. Spanish croquettes. They're kind of like the British croquettes, but they don't have potato inside. They have a kind of bechamel sauce mixture inside with either chicken or ham. Some people do croquetas de boletos, like mushroom croquettes. They are super delicious, like really crispy, crunchy on the outside and soft on the inside. Then we have pulpo a la gallega. This is octopus and it's called Galician octopus because it's very famous in the region of Galicia in the north of Spain and this is just basically boiled octopus in paprika it's really nice like I'm not really a lover of seafood but this octopus is really really delicious in Galicia they eat it on a wooden board with some boiled potatoes as well then we have patatas bravas diced potato fried and then with a sauce like it's kind of like a little bit of a spicy sauce not too spicy because Spanish food in general is not spicy Spanish people don't like spicy food and they can also put alioli which is garlic mayo they put that sauce over the patatas bravas as well then we have calamari a la romana rings of squid fried in batter they are so good like they're so crispy the squid is really chewy you can either eat that with alioli with garlic mayo or with just mayo you can dip like the squid in the mayo people put lemon juice over the calamari they are so good with like a nice refreshing salad then we have rabas de calamar this again is squid but instead of squid rings it's squid strips put into breadcrumbs and fried and they are so good as well. Again, with lemon, mayo, and a salad. Then we have the famous paella. It's very famous in the region of Valencia in Spain. And this rice can have lots of different things in it. A lot of people put rabbit, chicken, and seafood in it. There's lots of different varieties. You can have like vegetarian paella, or seafood paella, or meat paella, and it's super, super yummy. Then we have cochinillo. Cochinillo is a little tiny baby pig. Like, when I think about that, I'm like, oh, yuck. Like, you know, I feel so bad for the little baby pig. Because they do, they basically just get a wee baby pig and kill it and cook it. I don't like that at all. <laughs> but anyway, cochinillo. The thought of it, horrible. It actually tastes really delicious. It's amazing. I've only tasted it once. I don't want to taste it again just because I don't want to eat a baby pig. But to try it, you should try it. Like it's really, really delicious. Then we have chorizo a la sidra. Chorizo is famous in Spain. I mean, you can buy it in the UK. Chorizo, I think they say, you know, chorizo is it? I don't know. But chorizo is Spanish sausage and it's super yummy. And this is chorizo cooked in cider. And finally we have morfia. Morfia is actually made with blood. 
But if you like black pudding, then you'll like it. It's like rice with pig's blood. And if you think about it, it's not very nice, but it actually tastes amazing. So that's another dish you should definitely try if you ever come to Spain. Anyway, there's so much more. Like, Spain has amazing food. Just come. Come to Spain and try all the food. Because you will not be disappointed, I promise. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. And I will see you in the next one.